Registering voters can be a great way to boost your numbers at the polls, but it's important to be strategic about where you set up your drive and who you approach. College campuses are a great place to start because students have often just reached voting age. Devoutly religious campuses tend to be more conservative, while larger state schools will usually lean more liberal. You can also reach out directly to campus clubs. Pro-life clubs and Students for Concealed Carry are obvious choices for conservatives, while feminist groups and Students for Democratic Society would clearly be more liberal. Similarly, like a student, choose your major wisely. Business school buildings have more conservatives, while arts buildings tend to have more liberals. Outside of universities, special interest groups are probably not worth your time because their members will likely already be registered. Community events and sporting events are also great places to go, but again, be strategic. NASCAR games, gun shows, and events affiliated with evangelical groups are all great places to find conservatives, while organic markets and independent film festivals are often more liberal. Remember not to sit behind your table and let them come to you, but instead actively ask passers-by if they are registered to vote. It is also important to check your local legal requirements for voter registration. There's nothing worse than seeing all your hard work go to waste because you missed a small legal detail. If you have the manpower, going door to door can also be a great way to register voters. Your political party should be able to give you helpful guidelines on which neighborhoods are mostly friendly to your views. You can also look for clues such as bumper stickers and flags on homes to determine whether or not to knock on that particular door. Voter registration can be a great path to victory if you work hard and learn to follow the trends in your community.